Uh, this is Tim Barker with the uh, Post Dispatch. We're here in Cape Girardeau, where we've just listened to uh, uh, Governor Sarah Palin speak to supporters. And I'm outside the uh, Show Me Center. And uh, can you tell us a little bit about yourself? My name is Dorothy Arnton. I'm a retired school teacher, mother of seven, grandmother of seven, of twenty-four, and great grandmother of three so far. That's a lot. And um, I'm very interested in politics because mm-hmm. I feel that it's the future of our country depends on being elected and the right to elect our representatives. Very privileged. Yeah. Yeah. Now, um, how long, did you get here early today to get in? Yes. What, yes. what time did you get in? We couldn't let you strand a good tent. I don't know. Yeah, I don't we know. left home at <laughs> 6, and it's about 35, 40 minutes yeah. to get yeah. here, so we've been here a while. What do you find is to be the most important issue this uh, election? Well, to me, the determinant between Obama and, and Ms. Palin was the fact that Obama was so adamantly in favor of abortion. Mm-hmm. Now, I can understand people disagreeing with that thing, but he was so adamantly pro-abortion that it, uh, it repulsed me. Is that a, a key issue for you? Very definitely. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, but what? When you leave, not the only. Issue, not the only. But my opinion is that if a person doesn't have the right to be born and have life, all these other social programs are kind of useless. Yeah. When you leave today, what's what do you think you're going to remember the most about uh, Governor Palin's talk? Um, just the overall tone of it. She she's just got such credit, mm-hmm. and she's so. So much there. Yeah. Why do you think those two are, are most qualified to lead this country? Well, I haven't seen much that would tell me that Mr. Obama is qualified. Other than he's very charismatic and speaks well. Um, Mr. McCain has definitely had some experience in Congress. And he is somewhat of a maverick. He goes by what he believes. And um, Mrs. Palin has had experience in a variety of ways. Besides her political experience, I think she would relate more likely to families and their problems. Mm-hmm. And that's I cannot tell you any one thing about her that I like everything I like. <laughs> well, thanks for your thoughts. Uh, again, this is Tim Barker with the Post-Dispatch. For more of our political coverage, go to stltoday.com slash politics. Thank you. You were my best interview of the day. Oh, well, thank you so much. You're very kind. Thanks a lot. It was nice yes, meeting you. Yes, it was you. nice thanks. meeting you, too.